the channel, same day, different video. So this is going to kind of piggyback off of the other video, and the other video is a link right here and above. What that link was to is a shelf unit for your drills and miscellaneous stuff, whatever you want to put on it. It's pretty cool, pretty neat, gets everything up off the ground, up on the wall so you can easily find it and it looks pretty cool and it's budget friendly. So this one here is, it's a little bit different but piggybacks off because we're using the same leftover materials as that we did from the previous video. So same pallets, when I took apart the pallets, I've, I'm recycling that wood. So what it is is I took off the, the support legs off the pallets and I'm using this pretty much unfinished wood from the planer, from the pallets, planks that go across. Now for my application, this is the correct height for what I need it for. And then I need 11 and a half wide for my space so I can fit it in my corner over there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go through every plank of these. I'm gonna mark off 11 and a half. I'm gonna go over to the chop saw. I'm gonna chop it up. Then we're gonna come back on over. We're gonna assemble it and then we're gonna stain it and then I'm gonna show you what it looks like. All right, stay tuned. So after you've chopped them all up to length, you got your height that you need. What you want to do is to make sure that these puppies are going to fit. Because you're going to want to put them here already. And then you're going to mark it right on the edges. Or you just go right ahead, you leave them in it, and you drill those puppies right on in. It's that simple. So now that you pretty much know how to do this, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to fast forward, and I'm going to do all the rest of the way going up. And I'll show you what the end result looks like. new day same video so now what we're gonna do is you're gonna take our shelf you are going to measure it or trace it onto the pegboard so they come white and brown this is leftover from previous it used to be right there but now I got two white ones to help reflect off the LED lights I have up on top for an easier vision so this one's gonna be brown if I want I can paint it if not I mean it's, I really don't care so I got all set here. I'm going to go and cut out this back piece here, which is going to get screwed on to the shelf itself. And then we're going to be able to mount it right onto the wall right over there and help sort up some of this clustered mess right here. All right, now that you got a cut to fit the back of it, what you're going to do is now you're going to nail it or screw it in. All right, we are all done with the project. It is amazing what you can do with your hands and just a little bit of time and, and energy. And so let's check it out. 